Kelsey. And my name is Becky. And we are the Story Girls, and today we're doing a fun little video. We're gonna do date ideas from the thrift store outfits. Outfits for date ideas. You got it, yeah. This is also really appropriate because Valentine's Day is coming up shortly. So we put some uh, date ideas on little pieces of paper here, mm -hmm. and we're going to choose them from a hat and figure out what we need to get at the thrift store. My first date. Skating. Skating slash outdoor activities. And if you guys don't know, we're in Canada, so that involves a winter wonderland, so I'm gonna have to dress appropriately. <laughs> what do you got? Staying in. Fun. My kind of night. <laughs> I'm gonna go with this one. Ooh, a nice dinner out in brackets. Fancy. And last one. Dive bar and dancing. Ooh. Okay, that's literally my kind of night. So with these themes slash dates in mind, we're gonna go to the thrift store build outfits like entirely from the thrift store, like ground up. Except for underwear. Yeah, because that's gross. Oh, hell no. Nope, 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 nope. And make looks, and then we'll come back and style them for you. Okay, bye. Bye. Excuse me, ma'am. Keep moving. So many options. I think it would help if I think of an outfit idea and then shop. It was amazing, though. I'm just going to get this. For the outdoor one, I think we're definitely gonna need a coat, so I'm heading to coats first to see what I can find. I mean, this is already really nice. I'm just gonna make a giant maybe pile. This is so styling, but I think it's gonna be massive on me. I'm gonna throw it in the maybe pile anyways. Every Canadian girl remembers this. Tina. Ooh, you cute. Total Belle Beauty and the Beast vibe. Wish I had a Disney party to go to right now. All right, I'm having the opposite of the problem I thought I was gonna have. I have way too much stuff. All right, I narrowed it down to a more manageable size, so I'm gonna go try some stuff on. That's a problem. This was cute in theory, but what is going on here? These are the pants I think I wanna do for skating night, but I have lots of sweater options. All right, one, two, but uh, this is already a no, or three. So cute, but my size is too big. This is the coat that I thought would be huge on me, and I wasn't wrong. All right, so my outfits are pretty much sorted, but I'll show you them later, but I need to figure out shoes to go with all of these things. Yep, these are totally date night walking out in the snow acceptable. Perfect. When your shoes look more thrift store than the thrift store shoes. <laughs> Hello, um, Becky. I just found the cutest Tory Burch heel booty in your size. These were a good idea in theory, but um, we don't have a budget, but these just blew <laughs> but it's it. not in it. $90? All right, we're back. We're gonna haul our haul for you. For staying in, I um, couldn't find sweatpants, so I went to Ooh. the child section. So these are men's, not men's, boys' <laughs> pants, but I think they're really cute. And I also got this like just cropped, kind of very mod, Blush oh. pink. Oh yeah. Valentine's Day. Yeah. That's also so good. Things I will wear no. after this video, which yes. is a good thing. And lastly, I got this little headband um, or handkerchief because it's like a night in, so it's like don't even do your hair. Oh, so yeah. cute, right? I just thought I wanted one more thing to pull the outfit together. For my fancy dinner outfit, I found this floral short romper, but it's short, like they're short, so they're really short, which might not be like totally appropriate for every fancy restaurant. So you have a romper, throw a skirt over it and it instantly makes it more fancy. So this is just a black skirt that goes over top. And then for shoes, I found just these little black pointy heels because you can't go wrong with a little black heel, mm -hmm. LB, LBH. It's a thing, a little black heel. <laughs> and these are great. And they actually seem like almost pretty much brand new. So this outfit I'm really excited about. This is my dancing slash dive bar outfit. I'll show you guys some B-roll footage here. Um, I was trying to decide between a couple of different outfits. I had like the same kind of vibe going on, just like different colors mm -hmm. and different type of skirt. But I ended up going with this camel skirt and then I'm pairing it with a black turtleneck, which like I just love wearing turtlenecks this time of year. I found this amazing cabby newsy, whatever you want to call it, hat. This one's like probably the most vintage. No, it's so like rock star. It's cool. It's so, it's very cool. And I already have one, but like. Do you have one that makes it look like you're in a biker gang? No, <laughs> I don't. And also these shoes were such a good find. They're like nine bucks, very cute. And like one of the few shoes that were cute in my size. And lastly, I have my skating slash outdoor activities outfits. For pants, 
I found these were actually in the leggings aisle. You definitely found those um, before I got to the legging aisle. Because you would have stolen them. They are amazing. They're just like this brown, like stretchy material and then they have this faux leather stripe down the side which are so good. People that say you can't wear leggings as pants like have not seen these pants. On top of that I just found this white knit sweater that's super soft and since we're gonna be outside I needed to get a jacket. So they had so many good long wool winter coats yeah. so if you need like a really nice jacket because these are expensive in the stores. Yeah yeah like, like over 100 bucks. Over 100 bucks and like, we got this big black wool one or fake wool I don't know <laughs> but uh, whatever it is but it's super nice and trendy and gonna keep me warm. To pair it with it, I just got these black boots that are in really good shape too, especially for the thrift store. They're just practical, nice shoes. If you're gonna be outside, you can't really wear heels in the snow. I mean, you can, but I wouldn't. <laughs> lastly, I just found this white knitted beanie with a pom-pom that actually matches the sweater like so perfectly. perfectly. Prices for these guys. My staying in outfit ended up costing $20. And my date night slash fancy dinner out outfit ended up costing $36, which still ain't bad. Costs more than like the entree. <laughs> Wait, costs Wait, less. less. Costs less. That's the kind of place I wanna go to. My dancing slash dive bar outfit ended up costing 32 bucks, which is a steal, including shoes. And then my outdoor slash skating outfit ended up costing me $59, but that was with the coat that was $20 and these really nice shoes. So honestly, to get all this plus a nice winter coat for under $60, like, are you kidding? And reduce, reuse, upcycle, re recycle. recycle. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like stuff like this, make sure that you give it a like. Um, subscribe so that we see you on all the days that we're uploading now. Yeah, we do lots of thrift store stuff, lots of thrift store upcycles, and we might make this outfit from the thrift store thing more of a thing more often, so let us know below. We do like our series, but now we're gonna have like lifestyle series. Like, this is getting too much, guys. Everything is a series. All right, thank you guys for watching. If you like it, make sure you like it. And if you love it, make sure you sub it. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.